Welcome to 5-Minute German Grammar. Thank you for watching. This presentation will introduce negation using nicht and kein. In German, the adverb nicht can be used before adjectives and other adverbs to negate them. In the sentence you see here, der Zug ist groß, the train is large. The predicate adjective groß comes after the linking verb and describes a characteristic of the noun. To negate this adjective, we simply need to insert nicht before it. Der Zug ist nicht groß. The train is not large. We can do the same with adverbs. In this sentence, der Zug fährt schnell, the train runs fast, the adverb schnell describes the manner in which the train is running. To negate this adverb, we also insert nicht before it. Der Zug fährt nicht schnell, the train doesn't run fast. When negating adjectives and adverbs with nicht, we can provide additional contrasting information by using the coordinating conjunction sondern, meaning but or rather. Der Zug fährt nicht schnell, sondern langsam. The train doesn't run fast, but rather slow. Note that you need to use a comma before sondern to mark the end of the clause. We'll cover coordinating conjunctions in more detail in a later presentation. When negating entire sentences and clauses, however, nicht must come at the very end. The sentence you see here, der Zug fährt, is a simple clause consisting of a subject, der Zug, and a verb, fährt. To negate this clause, you simply need to insert nicht at the very end. Der Zug fährt nicht. The train is not running. We'll negate a more complex clause at the end of this presentation. We use nicht to negate adjectives, adverbs, and clauses. When negating nouns, however, we must use the negative indefinite article kein. You will notice that the declension pattern for kein is exactly the same as for the indefinite article ein. You may want to quickly review the presentation on, den, on indefinite articles before proceeding with this one. Let's take a closer look at how kein functions. In the sentence you see here, ich sehe einen Zug, I see a train, the direct object of the sentence is einen Zug, as it receives the action of the verb sehe. Here the direct object is indicated by the masculine accusative ending on the indefinite article. To negate this sentence, we simply need to change einen into keinen. Ich sehe keinen Zug. I don't see a train or I don't see any train. Note, however, that we can only negate indefinite nouns in this manner, meaning nouns that are preceded by an indefinite article. Nouns that are preceded by a definite article require the use of nicht at the end of the clause. Ich sehe den Zug nicht. I do not see the train. The five-minute German grammar series is produced by David Neville, Associate Professor of German. The video scripts and lecture slides are released under a Creative Commons attribution, non-commercial, share-alike 4.0 international license. Don't be a square. Remix and share.